to that I would like to talk about and that's my actual trip I know I'm already doing like this what well, putting together this vlog now like weeks after I've come back but I will be gone again and more content will be coming soon but yeah I actually just wanted to talk about the Maldives if any of you have like super specific questions hopefully I can answer them but you can DM me because I probably will not touch on very specific things right now first things first you cannot take alcohol, okay? I didn't read the laws of that country before I left. They took my Ciroc at the airport. They even singled us out, do you know what I mean? Like, they didn't search everyone's bags, but they looked at us and they said, you, wazala. And I was like, bro, bro, what about us? Anyway, yeah, that sucked. But we got it when we went back, when we flew back. So they kind of keep it there for you, but it's, alcohol is illegal in the Maldives. They are like 100% an Islam like nation. And so, yeah, that kind of goes against their religion and the laws itself of their country. But on the islands, um, like at the resorts, you do have access to alcohol, but it is quite pricey. Everything is in dollars, dollar doll bills. <laughs> Get your dollars, you know, in order. In order. Uh, it's, yeah, like the cheapest bottle of wine was seven it was converted. converted it is 750 rand that's the cheapest so just to give you context there was not a cocktail cheaper than ten dollars yeah, you can just do the math and kind of gauge like when you go on holiday they are gonna be you kind of need to read up on it a little bit before but what to expect you know don't be blindsided like me bro i was so heartbroken when they took out apples from row because they were what? what i love it, it. She went. where am i getting back where i can't speak Look at the, the yacht in the back oh, there. Oh, the over there. Look over there, the best place of our land.
Okay, so obviously we're already set up. Do they have my favorite espresso machine? <laughs> Guys, please look at how big, how big this can. I can't even like, it's a big can. It's a very long can. And that worries me because what the hell is crawling here? Um, where we need such a large can. But anyway. Love a good shower. The people watching this be like, Rosa doesn't like to shower, but I mean, fuck you guys. Whatever. I do like to shower sometimes. Can you say something that's like a nice toilet? I don't know, I'm not sure. And it's open, bros. It's freaking open. But it's so humid, guys. So whenever you come into the bathroom, super, super hot. And we've got a nice bathtub here. Yes, yes.
mengubari berang Halo, bersik Mami Mami That way. Oh man, what's wrong?
can see the name it's written in top in the gold color it says Masjid al Sultan Muhammad Takurufan al Azam in the name of Sultan. busy building artificial coral and putting it in the water because you guys took the mm. coral to come here no. coral in one year they grow one in uh, all hand -made. i knew it and also uh, most of these designs over here we can see in our wood walks and some of the There's definitely a, a duty on your part as a tourist or a visitor in a country to respect that culture. Even though I love to, I love to enjoy a drink or seven, but it's just important to like be respectful and aware um, of people's cultures, even if you don't understand it or agree with it. Um, but yes, what else can I tell you? Uh, unfortunately, we weren't able to island hop which is kind of our plan, <laughs> but we weren't able to island hop because of COVID, but I think they will be um, sort of relaxing those restrictions in maybe the next year or so. Another tip or that we kind of learned from other um, visitors at our resort was that they kind of book like three nights at this resort and then three nights at another resort. And then if you want to another three nights and another three nights, but you get the idea so that you can experience like different things at different resorts or different parts of that ocean and culture have to offer there are also um, a few islands that um where there's just locals that live there which is also apparently a really nice thing to experience that we weren't able to but yeah it's really nice to see how how locals operate and and um, do things it's very different to being on the islands where you're like served all the time just like in la la land no i hope to i'm definitely going back but yes, any specific questions, y'all hit me up. Um, my socials will be somewhere, 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 here, somewhere here, here at the end. At the end. <laughs> Bye! Thanks for listening! <laughs>